there's one thing that 99% of you aren't doing right now that will instantly help increase your attraction to women. And this one thing actually only takes you about a few minutes each day, and more specifically, the time of day in which you do it is going to be very, very important. All right, so the thing that I'm talking about is cold showers. Now, cold showers, you might be thinking to yourself, oh, why the hell would that actually increase my attraction to women, right? Like you might be thinking, oh, well, maybe it like helps with my skin or, or whatever that make me more Chad like not necessarily really what it comes down to is the mindset behind cold showers. And I can tell you from personal experience of what's going on in my life right now. So right now I'm living in Las Vegas. I'm making it sort of a personal challenge of mine to go out as often as possible while completely sober, no alcohol to really just kind of destroy my approach anxiety, social anxiety, social shyness to bits. And one of the biggest things that kind of inhibits you from going and approaching that really attractive girl, going to talk her up, uh, going out and socializing with strangers is that initial first approach when you first start your night, right? Going up to that girl. It's almost like there's this invisible barrier like this, this super, like almost anti-magnetic force between you and her as you start to get closer to each other, as she starts walking towards you and you start walking toward her. And then these emotions start building up, these negative emotions, these doubts, but the fact that you think you might get rejected, you might look like an idiot. I don't like Ruth. <laughs> I'm sorry, I pissed it out. Right? And there's so much resistance there. But if you're able to overcome that, then the rest of the night starts to become easy. It starts to become fun. And you start to get what the pickup artist would call like in state. And then you could just start approaching everybody, right? You just become super sociable. It's more that state change from you just kind of being in your own head to you being in a, in a very extroverted and social mood. And so that state change is what's key. So how does this relate to cold showers? Well, when you start doing cold showers, the toughest part is like the first, you know, 30 seconds. And actually what's even tougher than that is just jumping right into the cold shower because as soon as you turn the shower knob to the coldest setting, it's icy cold, um, you stick your hand out and you're just like, oh my gosh, that's really, really cold. And so, this happens, uh, especially the first few times I started doing it, I would just sit in front of the cold, right? So I'd have the, the water coming down <laughs> and I'd be like slightly away from it. I could feel the water splashing on the floor and up toward me so I could feel the coldness a bit, but I just keep thinking like, oh my God, I don't wanna do this. I don't wanna do this. I don't wanna do this. But then eventually you work up the courage and then you just dive right in. And at first the, the coldness and the iciness, it just, it jolts you, right? It's a shock and it's pretty excruciating, honestly, for the first like 10, 15 seconds or so. But then you start to get used to it and then you start to accept that pain, you accept that iciness. And then eventually it actually starts to feel not that bad, right? And it's actually the very same exact thing when it comes to, you know, approaching uh, beautiful girls because when you're initially doing that first approach, it's so nerve wracking, right? But you just gotta do it. And then once you start doing it, then similar to how cold showers start to actually feel good after you're in there for you know about a minute or so and it doesn't feel that bad, it's the same exact thing with you going around and approaching attractive women. The parallels are, are insane. Excuse me, you're like really cute. You're like just like, just my type. Wow, you girls look adorable. <laughs> I can't decide which one of you I like the most. Are these your parents? Yes, they oh, are. Oh, my bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> your daughter's very beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> and so for me, what I started to do is before I would go out, because I naturally suffer from social shyness, social anxiety, um, I would take these cold showers right before. And it would, one, put me in the right state because cold showers help to increase your dopamine levels temporarily after you take them. But also it helps put me in that right mindset of like, well, 
I know what it takes to go from one state to drastically changing to another state. And by basically habituating and practicing doing that, that sort of act of courage, it translates over to other parts of your life where courage is required, such as going and just approaching a beautiful girl, right? And so the parallels are just, it's absolutely incredible. And it's something that I highly suggest every single one of you guys do, you know, even if you're not in the dating space or you're not trying to go out there and, and meet new women right now, maybe you're in a relationship, may, maybe you're married, but if you're uh, nervous before a big job interview or, uh, you know, you work in sales and you're about, you're about to have a consultation with a big client, um, whatever it might be, taking a cold shower a little bit before that will put you in that right mindset. Um, again, physiological benefits aside, the psychological benefits, the spiritual benefits, the mindset benefits, it's, it's absolutely incredible and I highly suggest. And actually, I'm going to be covering this a little bit more in depth in my free ebook, which is going to be coming out soon called the Ubermensch Mindset, uh, which is heavily inspired by Friedrich Nietzsche, which, you know, uh, he's kind of the, a lot of the things he talks about is the basis of a lot of the things I talk about on this channel. So uh, go ahead and download that when it comes out, depending on when you watch this, it might already be out. So check the link in the description. Let me know what you think about cold showers and how you, after watching this video, plan on implementing it into your own life. Thanks for watching.